Natalie, you can't. It's too dangerous out there. Look, we don't know that. No, we don't. So you, you want to risk your life just to what? Sit inside your house instead alone? I'm not going to my house. I'm going home. My home is with him. What are you doing? Bye. But you'll die. I have no business being alive. Natalie is really at that moment that people can reach when they take the step of taking their own life. Natalie lost Benedict in in the pilot and in episode two she's she's grieving. The sorrow from, from losing him starts tearing her apart. She decides to basically go out into the mist and, and die with her husband. Mikhail runs out and tries to save her when something pretty gruesome happens. <laughs> There's something on me. No! Alps! Oh, there's something on me. There's something on my back. Get it off of me. Ah! There's something there. Get it off. It's the first time that we see some of the awesome power of the mist. Now, I've seen Pundit and what happens with him, which is terrifying and grotesque, but it didn't, it wasn't this complete portal to hell. Action. This transformation of a young man into this almost godlike, iconic figure is beautiful and transcending and um, life altering for her. Nature speaking to her, it's profound. Right. And action. It's getting thicker. Natalie, it's getting thicker. Right now we are shooting my demise and the uh, the moth tattoo is coming out of my back and uh, pretty much bubbling and exploding and uh, being taken in by the mist. Natalie has some sort of connection on this spiritual plane to whatever is happening. It's not some sort of physical disaster or something beyond that's happening in the mist. It's touching other worlds in some way, and she has some vision into that. And they've all known one another in this town for a while, but it seems that there is a, a sympathy between Connor and Natalie that I believe builds as the storyline goes on. It certainly becomes the inciting incident in Natalie formulating her theory or her own almost little religion about what is going on. She starts speculating that this is somehow nature coming alive. Did you see it? Did you see it? Do you think I could get in here? What the hell was that? Did you see yes, it? Yes, 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 I saw it. Why did you go out there? Because I wanted to die. Mrs. Raven, please. It's okay, I don't want to die anymore. I'm happy. I've seen God. Mrs. Raven, you are in shock, please. That wasn't God. I'm not talking about your God. <laughs> 